Each year, the South Carolina Criminal Justice Academy takes in almost 1,500 recruits. If they successfully make it through, they will eventually be on the streets making life and death decisions. Keep in mind, anybody who's involved in that type of situation is down to seconds to make a decision. While the Criminal Justice Academy doesn't comment on shootings like that, they do prepare officers to be ready for anything. Did the officer feel that they were in danger? Did the life of someone else was in danger? And we teach them the legalities of it, the legal portion of it, um, when you can and when you cannot. Um, we actually do the physical side of it. You know, if you pull your, your weapon, these are the things that can happen. And then we actually do the firearms training where they're proficient in their actual tr um, training. The training is required by all law enforcement agencies around the state. In the 12 weeks of preparations, officers in training are coached on basic self-defense, driving lessons, arrest procedures, and how and when to use a firearm. There's a lot of different mechanics that they must are required to pass in order to be certified as a law enforcement officer for this state. Major Florence McCant says teaching the officers what to do in a situation where they may need to use their weapon is part of everyday training. We will show them various different scenarios of when a shoot, don't shoot situation. If you would shoot in this situation, tell us why you would shoot. It's there to protect the officer and the people that we serve. All preparations officials hope graduates take with them into the line of duty. In Columbia, Shelly Domchek, Watch Fox News.